Today, we're making snowy calming jars. Some simply required. Years ago, like years, do you even remember making this? A little. Years ago, we made this cool glittery calming jar. Uh... Ooh, doesn't that make you feel calmer already? <sighs> I really could actually just watch that. But that's not why you're here. So we are going to make one just like this, as much as we can remember, except sort of a wintry holiday kind of a theme. So here is what you'll need. We'll use warm water, not too hot, a funnel, glitter glue, we chose sort of an iridescent whitish snowy, I guess. We also picked an iridescent whitish glitter. You can use chunkier glitter and finer glitter. We just are using the one. We have some little jingle bells to stick in. I found last time that putting some kind of beads or something like that will kind of help the glitter to sort of scoop up off the bottom, not get too clumpy. Mm -hmm. um, we also recently heard that a little bit of dish soap is also supposed to keep the glitter from clumping. We'll find out if that's true or not. And we are using this glass jar that we got from Ikea. If you think it's a better idea, you could use a plastic water bottle kind of thing, especially those cool water bottles that come in the nice shapes. <laughs> water bottles these days. Something like that would be cool and probably safer if you're working with someone who's going to definitely drop it on the floor. So it's your choice. We're using glass because we basically found it and said, oh, we should make another one of those glitter jars. So that's where we are. So here's how you do it. There are a lot of different ways to make this. So uh, we're gonna make it in the way that makes sense to us and you may change it up, see what works for us and what doesn't, and then don't do that. So the first thing that you do is pour halfway-ish, maybe a third of the way with the water. I'm going to save the funnel for the glitter because I think that that is probably going to need it more. So we may have to pause to add um, paper towels. <laughs> so I will just try to pour this in. Okay, paper towels. So as I was saying, definitely put down a paper towel because you can spill. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, the next step is to add they say 60 milliliters of glitter glue. That is a little bit more than half of this. We're probably gonna add more. Can I squeeze it? Yeah. Thanks. Yeah, this is definitely a highlight. So enjoy this part. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that's probably plenty. We can always add a little bit more at the end if we mm -hmm. feel like we need a little bit more glue. That looks mm -hmm. so cool. It does look really cool. <laughs> I don't even need to add anything else. This is great. So now we'll just stir it up a little bit to make sure that we combine the glue and the water. Very nice. I think that's good. Yeah, it's good for now. We can always do more stirring when we have the glitter. Great. It's a little bit gluey, but that's cool. So then the second funnest part, depending on how you feel about glitter, <laughs> is to add the glitter. I'll hold this you pour in the glitter. We'll see how it goes. All right, so we'll add a lot more. We'll just add a bunch. I mean, who doesn't like glitter? I mean, the whole purpose of this is to watch the glitter in the jar, so... I might as well put in some glitter. Smart glitter. Put the whole thing in. Yeah, whole thing. This could be one of those learn from my mistakes moments. <laughs> yeah. But what could possibly go wrong? I can think of a few things. Okay, and now we're gonna just wow, tap it all in. in. Put that one everywhere. A little bit everywhere. <laughs> That's why we went outside last time. Did we? Yeah, we did it that outside. That was smart. Let's do another oh, oh my God, stirring. So excited. 
<laughs> That's funny. I'll just make sure that doesn't fall over, shall I? Okay, so, um, might have put a little much glitter. Well, we still have a bunch more water that we can put in. Oh, that's good. Right, because we're gonna fill it up. Lovely. Okay, good. Then, why don't we at this point also put the jingle bells in? They're not gonna jingle once they're in there, but yeah. that's okay. <laughs> so, do you think we should put all of them in? Yes. Or just a go dokey just a little bit too big. Let's do it this way instead. That looks fun. They make a nice sound. They when do they, make when kind you of a lovely sound. That's everybody. Good morning. Can you hear that? I hope so. Now, since our paper towel is already in place. What about this? And then we can put that in at the end. Oh. I guess. Oh, see, now it pours perfectly. <laughs> I'm gonna leave a little bit of space for air because the bubbles could have left a lot of space for air in that one. But I think it also helps to kind of um, scramble everything up again. So a little squirt. And then I'll stir it carefully because we're quite high. Now, let's see if it works. We'll put the cover on mm -hmm. and then test it out. Climb on it. And we'll also see if it how strong our seal is. All right, let's try it out. Whoa. <laughs> There's the beads. <laughs> That's not bad. That's some good glitter swirling. It doesn't take a very, very long time. Maybe we should add more glue. Could try. Yeah, let's add more glue. We'll add a little bit more glue and see if that slows everything down a little bit more. So we poured a little bit of the water out just to make some room for more glue because it was getting stuck in the bubbles. And then we can let some of the bubbles pop and then pour a little bit more water in but it's also kind of fun with the bubbles. It yeah. makes everything keep going. All right, demonstration number two. I like to make a tornado. Yeah, tornadoes are nice. That's pretty cool. So the things that we did differently in this one as opposed to this one, this blue guy we put in food coloring. So this, the water is a little bit blue, which is kind of cool. This one we were looking for a straight snowy day experience. Yeah. Plus jingle bells. We so we didn't want to put any- a sleigh. Yeah, yeah, we're just in a sleigh. The snow is coming at you. <laughs> <laughs> so we didn't want to change the color of the water, which you might want to do. I feel like you could do these in any kind of color, green or red, if you want it to be extra Christmassy. This one is just sort of winter. Yeah with jingle bells. Mm -hmm. I don't know. And I don't think that anything else was different with this one. I don't think that we used any soap, although you'd think we did because it's bubbly. And I think that we used a couple different kinds of glitter. So that's kind of a neat idea yeah. too. Um, but that's that's about it. But that's kind of fun. It's a little bit yellow. I, mean, I yeah, guess it doesn't fine. really look yellow for you guys. So maybe it's just me. Maybe it's the reflection. Yeah, it's a tiny bit, but it's like, it's fine. I like it. Yeah, it's all right. It's pretty cool. Yeah. That's all there is to it. One more thing that we haven't tried yet, and why not, is baby oil, which kind of makes sense because oil and water should repel each other and maybe make some interesting stuff happen in there. We'll find out. I don't know how much. How about that much? It smells good. But the oil is really cool. It does look cool. All right, let's shake it. Let's see what it looks like. Whoa, cool. Does it look cooler? Does it look any different? No. No. Well, cool experiment though. It might sort of help to break everything up, but it yeah. doesn't make the glitter stay in the, in the water any longer. It makes it, it a little cool. bit longer. I mean, it does. St well, there are the, the little bubbles kind of do make it slow down a little bit. 
Yeah, it's cool to see all the little bubbles trying to get back up to the top. It looks pretty anyway. If you yeah. don't have baby oil, that's fine. If you do, I don't know, throw some in. What's the harm? And then when it all settles, it kind of just looks like a snowy day. Yeah, like ground. Clouds. Uh. Clouds. <laughs> snow. So that was fun. Mm -hmm. Was that pretty fun? Yeah. I know. We can be like extra calm. <sighs> This one's still warm. <laughs> if you like this project, feel free to give it a thumbs up. Definitely try it. Tell some friends. If you like this kind of project and you're not subscribed yet, you can do that right underneath the video. Make sure you click all notifications so that you don't miss the next one. New videos come out on Tuesdays. And Saturdays. So stay tuned. And until the next video, be awesome. And we'll see you then. Bye! Bye! We'll be meditating.